continued today, but there was also a special ceremony and dedication for those who did not come home. The city of Puyallup honored the fallen with a very special memorial. Coma Force Denise Whitaker talked with a heartbroken mom still grieving the loss of her son. Sergeant Edward Smith. Private First Class, Alan Newton, Jr. One by one, the names of striker soldiers killed in action were read aloud. PFC James Miller. Specialist Michael Dahl. Specialist Michael Dahl died almost a year ago. His family came up from California for this special dedication. His mom told me she had to come. It makes me feel honored and it makes me feel special, you know, because I don't, I'm proud, you know, I'm proud because he gave 110%, you know, he didn't give 99%. Thousands of striker soldiers and their families came to remember those lost, now forever marked with this memorial. We had a very hard year, so to go through this is very important to the community and to the military as a whole. This memorial and the people of Puyallup are a rock. Colonel Huggins remarked these families who lost so much can never be made whole again. But soldiers say it does make a difference knowing they have this support in their communities. Just walking around, you know, my uniform, people just uh, thanking me for what I do, it's just, it, it feels great. It's just it's nice to know that the community is actually supporting us and know that we're here for a reason and now we're not wasting anybody's time. We know that the freedom of our nation is dependent on the courage of a few. And the home of the brave of the brave. We're all very thankful. A total of 39 strikers did not.